All right, guys, as promised, we are back. We're here to share with you our top goals for the new year. Yeah, because I have a lot. <laughs> Julie was given the assignment to write hers out, and you ended up with a ton. I did. They're not all, like, huge goals. Yeah, so you're going to limit it down to just the top few. Mm -hmm. I only have ten goals that I've written. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, well, because I wanted to keep it simple, you know? Me, Mr. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, let's get started. These are in no particular order for me. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you put yours in order oh, at all. I, I totally Probably didn't. not. No. <laughs> That's so, me. No, I didn't put them in order. All right, so my first goal, I've talked about this before a few times, is to finish my list of IMDb movies. If you guys are uh, familiar with the IMDb 250 list. It's the top list of movies, 250 movies, by critics and by the popular vote. It's just this great combination of really interesting films. Some are like really popular and good, others are like kind of obscure and, well, I don't want to say not good, but they're interesting. <laughs> so we're gonna, I'm gonna finish that up this year. I've got about 100 films, Boom. It's going to be done. I'll just say horror films are not quite our cup of tea. Yeah. That's okay. So, what is you, one of your goals, Julie? Oh, what am I? Gonna I haven't heard any of these yet, because Ju Julie just wrote them yeah, like, while we were preparing to like film. ten minutes ago. Uh, get into shape, so reach a healthy BMI. That's BMI. one of my goals, too! Rock on. Yes! You can't do that because you're putting <laughs> the camera up. <laughs> a big part of the reason why Julie has started her channel at, like she did is because we both recognized we needed to get back into better shape this year of not being on the road not being as active as we're used to and not eating as healthy and kind of a year full of stressful stressful stress, stress. I don't know it's just it's just crazy <laughs> it's just made us not as healthy as we want to be so we're both gonna get healthy all right my next goal is to finish a whole bunch of old <laughs> video projects that I have. Oh yes. I've got like six different projects. I I owe people videos <laughs> and I just need to like work and do them. I think I'm nervous to work on them because they're for people that I care about mm. and I don't ever want to disappoint people with my videos. And so it's like I just put them off. Realize your expectations are probably way higher than theirs. I, I realize this, yes. Mm -hmm. And it's time. Like some of these, some of these videos I've been sitting on for years not doing, and I just need to finish them. So this year I'm going to finish all of my old projects. So if, if by chance any of you who are watching are someone I owe in vi a video for, and you know who you are, I'm gonna finish it this year. I'm going to be a finisher. I'm going to be a finisher, that's right. <laughs> What's another one of your goals? Alright, hold on. Mm. <laughs> Finally be able to play a song on that wonderfully blasted guitar. Oh. <laughs> yes! Learn the guitar. And Good. I call it wonderful because I love guitar, but blasted because I've had that goal for a couple years yeah. now and still haven't been able to do it. See, the key... Mm -hmm. to to achieving that goal it's I easy. would think Special. is is creating the time for yes. for practicing you yes. just that's the hard part for us is creating time for anything my next goal is to make enough money to pay off our debts mm -hmm. and to follow some of the plans that we have I like that so it's always important right so I've got a whole bunch of ideas on how to do this only this new year will tell, though, you know, like, so that one's my goal. What's yours oh, next? Oh, yeah, sorry, I keep getting behind here. It's okay. I like your behind. <laughs> Weekly art sessions is what I want. Weekly art sessions, huh? Yeah, where it's just with myself. Giving basically. yourself some art time. Mm-hmm, to do whatever art I want, painting or drawing or sculpting or performance art or whatever it is. I love it. Yeah. I just thought of another one. Yeah? All right, share. I'm gonna have to write that. Oh, I want to learn how to like do the tricks and dance with that hula thing. Like you see a lot of like <laughs> cool people do it, 
like hoop cool, dancing. Cool hippies. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. In fact, I'm going to write down cool hippie hula dancer. <laughs> yes! Hippie. Ah, you hula. are fantastic. <laughs> dancing. It looks really fun. Mm hmm. I mean, it looks like it takes coordination, so <laughs> maybe a little inadequate for that, but you know, I can learn. Not inadequate, overqualified. <laughs> You are so, it's you so are, graceful. you are so coordinated that you've become uncoordinated. That's what I think. Yeah. By the way, look at how cute she is. She is adorable. Look at what she's wearing to bed. So cute. It looks like this, this 1900s swimming outfit. I love yeah, it. the little ruffles, little ruffles in the back. Ruffles on the bottom. Yeah. Love it. I want to... This new year, one of my goals is to make a thousand YouTube videos, which is a lot. What? A lot! <laughs> but to be fair, I count any of the videos I edit for Julie, and any videos on this channel, and then I've got a few other channels that I've kind of been working on. The kids have a toy channel. Abraham and the kids, other kids, want to do their own channels, so... Yeah, I think you're going to reach that goal. Right! I've got... I've got this plan, but I'm kind of going with this because whenever I set a goal for number of subscribers or views, it's like, I feel like that's so out of my control. Right. You know, I can't, I can't force people to subscribe. I can't force people to watch and, you know, I wouldn't want to. Right. Um, if people don't genuinely want to see what we're sharing, then I don't want them to have to. <laughs> So, so this was kind of a way that could give me a goal, YouTube oriented, that really I'm in control of. I like it. So, I like that. so a thousand videos. Look forward to it, guys. Um, that's going to be on this channel and Julie's and a few others. Mm -hmm. So, yay! You're awesome. What else? Uh, I want to achieve my mantra goal. Your which mantra is goal. Oh, that that you have in the bathroom. Well, believing it, yes, and I'm a wonderful person. I'm a beautiful person. And I love myself exactly as I am. I don't know it. Yeah, that's it. That should be easy. <laughs> easy! You think so? Well, I already think those things of you. Oh, I love you. I love you. I don't always believe that of myself. Mm. You should. <gasps> uh, bu, 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 bu. Oh, she, baby. She's like, why are we all still awake? <laughs> She's usually okay. trying to sleep at this time. So let's finish this up. Okay. Um, I want to learn a whole bunch of new things this year. And so I've put on here, put 300 hours of learning time in. Okay. Those are like tutorials or online classes or anything, anything that'll teach me new things. I want to log 300 <laughs> hours worth, which, I mean, that's like less than an hour a day. So total. So that's my plan. Do that. Um, does that every day include weekends? Yeah. Well, I mean, there's 365 days, mm -hmm. and then there's, and there's 300, 300 days. Hour. Okay. That's an average. Like, right. if I watch some sort of learning course that's two hours uh, long in a day, that's two hours. Yep, that's true. I actually have a place on my hard drive that I call Papa School, <laughs> and it's just full of tutorials and <laughs> online lessons that um. I've been just waiting to learn, just f trying to find the time. That's that's the key is yeah, time, time management. Right, I'm really bad at that sometimes. Let's see. Um, be more kind and compassionate. Yeah, you feel like you're not as kind and compassionate as you should be. Um, no, not recently. Yeah. I kind of am getting fed up with people, <laughs> and I don't know if that's so kind. You know. You I feel don't seem to have the patience for people right now. Right. There's there's a fine line. Well, some people, not all people. There's a fine line between kindness and compassion and just not letting people take advantage of you. Right. And I think I think finding that line is definitely a, a good goal. Trying to define exactly when you say Right. Nope. No, I'm done. <laughs> Well, I need to I need to create this kind bubble around people yeah. that, that 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 gives them the space to grow and change in yeah. my mind because we had this experience where I had to see someone and I hadn't seen them in a long time and I was like, oh, I don't want to deal with this person. Yeah. 
I don't want to deal with them and I don't want to have to bite my tongue and I don't want to have to be extra nice and right. and so but but that wasn't allowing them space to change because we all change throughout our lives and so that's true that's something I noticed was like that wasn't very kind of me to not allow her space to change right and you so. hadn't seen her for a long time right. and who knows maybe she right. was um not this you know maybe she had changed to the point that you'd agree more with her right right she's just not very nice sometimes so. <laughs> anyways i think i think we can all do that i think i think we can all work on being nicer even when mm -hmm. we are not letting people walk on us right if that makes sense right oh and and by the by the by by the by this person is no one that watches our youtube oh okay yeah. i thought maybe it was me <laughs> are you a she who knows who knows who knows i've got long hair i had a dream that you were a some she. people think i am i had a dream that you were a she yeah and i was a she and you know what yeah didn't change anything. Good. The kids on the school bus called me a girl because I they said I had long hair, oh and I'm like, boys can have long hair too, right. and they're like, uh uh. So I didn't really argue with them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> bus drivers aren't really meant to be the moral leaders of our youth. What? <laughs> I don't know. Not my place. All right. Next goal. <laughs> And this is probably the most important goal of all. Oh dear. I know which one it is then. I want to achieve level 40 on Pokemon Go. Yeah. I've been playing Pokemon Go since, what, 2016? Yeah. I've Two and a half years or so. Somewhere around there. I'm only level 31. 31. I'm like level 7. Which is like... Three million experience points you have to have get to get level 31. Anyways, I need to get myself to 20 million experience points by the end of the year. So this is a quick plug. Any of you who play Pokemon Go, who want to be my friend, I could desperately use your help to be my friend to reach this goal. So I'm going to put my Pokemon Go information down below so you can friend me. I could really use some help. Um, my Pokemon Go alias is Chunk Muffin 2. Chunk Muffin was already taken when I went to log in, went, registered the very first time, and I was a little disappointed, but I wasn't willing to give up the name. So I'm Chunk Muffin 2. Um, I would love to be your friend on Pokemon Go, and, and we could help each other to get to level 40. It's, it's a really important goal for me. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so that's one of my goals. What's your goal? I'm sorry, my screen keeps closing. Oh, grow my YouTube channel. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> grow it like a fungus. That's right. Hey, fungi do, do pretty well, yeah. so. If you guys have seen our last couple of videos, we've been trying to get the word out that Julie has a new channel. It's called Vegan, Vegan Sunshine. Sunshine. Yep. And uh, it's it's... We decided to, to, to make a separate channel because we know not everyone who watches Super and Sunshine wants to know about our vegan lifestyle. And so Julie wanted a space where she could just talk nonstop about being a vegan. Right. And so... And I wouldn't have to worry about offending people because... Right. If you're watching, you know that we're vegan. Right, and we don't mean to ever offend anyone, but it yeah. it happens kind of accidentally, just right. just when you have people who are different. And so we thought, well, this content, which is going to be like recipes and really vegan-centered topics, mm -hmm. and and some other stuff too. Yeah. But it's it's we're still trying to figure out exactly what it is, but it's definitely going to be more of Julie's space, more of her thinking and feeling mm -hmm. and opinions and uncensored right oh and by it's the way be awesome. um thank you to all the people that have subscribed and left yeah. comments. i really appreciate that support. yeah you guys are awesome i mean we just launched her channel the other day and you already have 44 subscribers right mm -hmm. incredible so thank you guys i know it's kind of a niche area the vegan area so we really appreciate those of you who are going over and checking out julie's channel and yeah she hopes to get out a video once About every once week or a so. Week. Yeah. Yep. Yay! Okay. Where? What is mine? Oh, that was pretty much it for me. Oh well, then I'll just go. 
Oh, yeah, okay. Well, no, oh, well, if you have Well, I was left. thinking, I've got one last one, and that's just to organize all my hard drive stuff. Right. I've got, okay, so... So many I've other been drives. recording family footage for, since I found my parents' Hi8 camera that's back right. in 99. In fact, I've got footage of us dancing before I left on my mission. Do, do. What? You should insert it right there. Oh, yeah. That footage of us dancing. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've got footage of us dancing before, um, before I left on my mission. We graduated high school in 99. Right! This is like when we were like, still liked each other back in the day. Um, anyways, okay. yeah. I've got like 40 terabytes worth of footage that spans from now back until like 99. And it's all just kind of in disarray. So yeah, I've got, I've got all this footage and it's not like it's organized per year, but it's organized per year, but I've never had a really good system. And I just kind of over the last year or so developed a system I really like. And so now I got to go through all my hard drives and apply it. And it's just, it's just really time intensive to go through 40 terabytes worth of footage and organize it in a special way. So that's my job. All right. My goals. Your goals. What's your goal? Get my t-shirt stuff. My get my shirt store up and running and successful. Oh, yeah. So explain that. You've had this idea for t-shirts right. for a long time. Yes, for over a year now. Yeah. And you've, you've actually designed a few. Mm -hmm. I've designed a few. I've taken notes on a... I probably have at least 100 ideas. Wow. Seriously. Yeah. That's and a I've lot. designed... I've designed about 20 of them, I think. Yeah. And I just need to upload them. But yeah, I have this. It'll be at a, an online store where um, it can be t shirts or coffee mugs or. Right, totes right. Or Novelty type oh, items. Oh, Bippy. Oh, well, we should get her to bed. Did you have any other goals um, that you want to share? Yeah, that's good. All right. She needs to go to bed. So, I mean, there are, there's tons of other stuff we want to work on this year, but those were some of our main focuses. Um, we'd love to know what your guys' goals are for this upcoming year. What are you guys going to work on? Um, I guess one of the biggest goals we have, too, I didn't really mention this much because it's kind of associated with my money goal, but it's just to start some new adventures for our family. You know, we've been living at my parents' house since we got kicked out of the <laughs> campgrounds. And I think it's about time, it's about time for us to, to figure out how to be on our own again. So uh, we've got some, we've got some plans in the works. All of it requires money, of course. So we've kind of been trying to be patient and saving up and, and getting ourselves to a spot. But we hope to be sharing all of our plans with you as they unfold for us. So, I think that's it. So yeah, let us know what your goals are for this year. We'd love to hear them. And we'd love to be there supporting you in your endeavors. Let us know how we can help with any of your goals. And don't forget, I need Pokemon friends. I'm serious, I really, really, really need more Pokemon friends. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. Thanks guys so much for watching and uh, we'll see you guys all another day. Spread love. <gasps> Ready? <gasps> <gasps> Silly. <laughs>